This program is brought to you by the Center for a Sustainable Today. Our world is an amazing, complex living organism, and we coexist in a symbiotic relationship. With this great power comes a great responsibility, a responsibility to ensure the future by taking steps to be sustainable today. And now, here is the host of Sustainable Today. Hello, and thanks for joining me on Sustainable Today, the show that helps you take action right now to become more sustainable, both at work and at home. I'm joined today by my co-host, Will Vallada, and I'm glad that you're here with me today. Thanks, Jean. I'm excited to be here, and I'm especially excited because today's show is about waste, and I'm a little bit of a tech geek, so I'm really excited to talk about e-waste. I'm a techno weenie, Will, so I'm hoping that we uh, have a have a good pairing between the two of us. I'll go easy on you. Okay, good. <laughs> well, I was at a sustainability training session a couple of years ago, and the instructor asked in this class, you know, when you toss something away, where is a way? Is there really an away? So he got me thinking about waste in a brand new way. And we have two guests with us uh, today who know about this topic. And uh, our first guest is Rick Winterhalter. And he is the chair of the Association of Oregon Recyclers. And Rick, you work in the Office of Sustainability at Clackamas County, right? I do. Thank you very much for having me. Mm -hmm. And we also have Greg Sampson, who's the National Programs Manager with CRT Processing, the company that's managing the state's new e-cycling program. Welcome, Greg. Thank you. 